this is a home page of the team city server so when you see the getting started with the team city that means you have successfully downloaded the team cities okay so to download the team city server you can go to the google and there you can type the team city download free version and when you search this one and you will get the first link get team city so jetbrains.com is the site and this official site and from there you can get the team city okay this is the ci cd server continuous integration and the deployment okay you click on this link and after that you will see this screen okay so this is the team city screen and on the right side you will see the cookies you are seeing this one you just say yes or no okay so i agree okay so this is the team city official website okay there and there you can see the team city logo is there so version uh 2021.1 build number this one and the last update of the 20 may so this is the latest version of the team city it is saying that after downloading the team city you can start using the team city under the free professional license right away means this is open source and this is enabled by default okay so to download the team city you have the download.exe so you click on the download button and in sometimes it will start downloading the team city you can see the team city is going to download this is the dot exe file okay we can check so what is the size 1.5 gb of this team city exe file so maybe it will take time to download once the download for the dot exe file is completed for the windows machine then we can install uh, this team city on the windows machine but before that i want to tell that if you are working with the linux or the macintosh operating system then you can select um, the, the version of the team city so linux you can select this one and then you can start download okay then it will start download the tar file the same thing for uh, when you want to download with the uh, macintosh so you can select this one and you can hit on the download it will start downloading the tar file but in this video i am going to discuss about the windows version of the team city so this is my download is completed to install the team city you have the .exe file and first you have to double click on this one so this is the latest version of the team city so just double click on it then it is verifying the installer please wait while the setup is loading so it will take time to load the setup after that you will see this window welcome to the JetBrains team city version setup wizard so you simply say next and there is some license agreement so you say i agree and where you want to install so destination for that is c drive team city okay and space required 1.6 space available no so you can say next and then you can install the build agent and the server okay windows service and windows service both are the windows service because we are using for the local purpose okay so we say next and then we will it will start installing the team city version of the setup wizard after that once the installation is complete successfully then you can see the team city server port number so this is the by default port number where the team city server web ui we can access okay if you have any other port number if this is already used in your systems so then you can provide the another port number okay so as of now i'm using this port number and then i say next okay now you can see that the uh, server url is this localhost 8111 okay i can access the team city server with this url now you can say save Kaizen property was saved to this build agent okay now team city under resident the system account and you okay so you have to select the system account not the user account okay 
then you can see the service so start build agent service and team city server service and then say next now you can see the completing the team city installation then open the team city gateway after setup is completed you this you can select the checkbox and when you say finish it will open the team city web ui now uh, we have the port number a triple one okay but we are not able to access this page so there could be the two regions the first is the team city server is not up and running the second one is that this port number is used already by some process how to do you can go to your team city where you have installed the team city then go to your bin and there you have the startup.batch file so this is for the windows this is for the linux okay so i am just going to start the team city server so basically it will run on, run on the tomcat server okay so we need the server is up and running so now you can see this startup configuration is required open team city web page and this the server is running with this url now again i will go to this url and i will refresh this code now you can see the team city first start so this is the first page of the team city okay and then uh, we click on the process okay. and if you want to restore from the backup you can do the backup but the location of the data is that that c users dot build server okay now i will say processed and this will initialize and start the team city first time for the local use and this is the team city build number 92579 now select the database type so we have the different type of the database type so which database you have installed on your machine mysql oracle ms sql server but i am using for the internal use on this local system so i am just click processed and team city is starting it will create a database so after that if you are seeing this window team city has dropped the support for internet explorer that means the internet explorer is not supported by the team city server so in that case what you can do you can launch the your uh, this one uh, the chrome driver and there you can type the local host okay uh, the sim and the local host at uh, port number 8111 when you launch this one it will ask you for the license agreement so you can go down okay this is the license agreement on the uh, chrome browser you accept the license and then continue now uh, it will ask you to create the administrator account okay you want or you can find like i will put my name test team cit team city and the password your password and the confirm okay login as a super user if you login as a super user then the authentication token is this one so but we are login as a normal user okay so you can provide the customize your test team okay and the password you can provide here and then create account can click on create account if you are logging with a super user in that case we will use so as of now you can leave this token create the account test team and this is the password so you can save so next time it will log in directly okay so this is the home page of the team city server so when you see the getting started with the team city that means you have successfully downloaded the team city server and install on the windows machine okay okay so in the next video we will see how to create the project and all internal you know configurations and the demo about the team city so i will try to make it a, as easy as possible okay